Hey guys, welcome to Stardew Valley. Today I'm going to be showing you a really quick way to make loads of money really, really quickly. It's pretty exciting and uh, what we're going to need is a whole bunch of wood that I've got here. I'll put my strawberry seeds back. Now last episode I went to the egg festival, uh, but I didn't save the game when I ended the episode. So when I started this again, I had to reload and redo the egg festival. But this time I won a straw hat. Pretty cool. Let's try it on in a bit. And also I got some strawberry seeds. But anyway, forget about that because I want to show you today the quick money trick. Now basically you need an axe and wood. And what you want to do is you want to go around your farm and get as much wood as you can. The total that you're going to need is 300. So that's the perfect excuse for us to just dig up some of these logs. Now if it's a brand new game, it shouldn't take you too long because I've spent my logs on like a lot of things, like chests for one. But yeah, what you want to do is dig up trees until you get 300 logs, and then it's time to head down to the beach. Now I've cleared a path down here, but it might not be immediately uh, possible for you to walk down this way from your farm. And if that's not the case, then you can always go around the long way. But we're gonna get, we're gonna head to the beach because what we want to do is repair the bridge there. Oh, and another trick actually, um, you know you can give different gifts, different precious gemstones as gifts to different ladies to, and men to kind of woo them. Apparently gems that are the same color as a person's hair work way better, so keep that in mind when you're giving gifts. Right, so what you want to do is if you've got 300 wood, you come over here and you say, yes, I'd like to use 300 pieces of wood to fix the bridge. Blam! And now you're thinking, okay, well you fixed the bridge and you've wasted 300 wood. What are you going to do now? Well, what we're going to do is we're going to run around and just pick up absolutely everything that's on the floor here. That's all of this coral. Whatever that is. Oh, sea urchin. Oh, well, to make some space, let's put on our straw hat. Oh, yeah, that looks really cool. An oyster. Oh, delicious. And okay, that's super quick. It's only 10.40 a.m. And we repaired the bridge and gathered up everything. Right, so now we're going to go and see Billy at the shop, and we're just going to sell all of this coral. Man, this sells for loads of gold, actually. Holy crap. Now, if you remember, we started today with about 1,300 coins, and now we've got 3,400. And, oh, that's before we even sold the oyster. So there you go. That is the quick money trick. Holy crap. So what are we going to spend all this gold on? Well, my hot tip, if you're fresh new into the game, is to get the backpack. You can make chests and store things at your farm, but honestly, the backpack that you can buy here for 2,000 gold is super useful. And bam, now suddenly we have twice as much room in our pack. And that means that we can carry all of our tools around at all times, which is very useful. Oh, and actually, this is Harvey. Ah, oh, this is the last guy. I must have completed the quest. There we go. And now we've got the next quest, how to win friends. Giving gifts is a great way to build friendships, learn each person's individual tastes, and you'll be popular in no time. Ah, oh, sweet. Well, what are we going to do, guys? Now, we decided last time that the woman for us was Leia because Robin was taken and she's the only other redhead in this town. Now, there's always Penny, but um, my waifu of choice is gonna be Leia, I think, for this playthrough. And if we play our cards right, we can ask her to dance at the dance festival. So we're gonna take Amethysts and the Clam and the Malachite, maybe the Geode. In fact, we're gonna take a lot of these things because we can, we can sell anything that we want to and need to now because we've got so much more inventory space. This is actually a real boon, a real kind of bonus for us. Now let's go and find Leia and choose carefully what we're going to give her as a gift because you can only give a gift two times a week. Before we hit town though to try and track down Leia, we're also going to plant our strawberries. Now you can get these at the egg festival and truth be told, we probably should have planted them last night as soon as the egg festival finished, but Better late than never. We've got 10 seeds now. Now, strawberry seeds grow after eight days and then they continually produce fruit. But now it's time to track down Leia and see if we can woo her with a very special gift. Now, the stardewvalleywiki.com has information on every single woman in Stardew Valley. And these are the details on Leia. So she's a villager, 
and this is her schedule. Oh, wow. Super stalker mode. You can even tell when she leaves her house, where she goes, what she does on Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday and Sunday. Wow, people have tracked her down all days of the week. She is such a beauty, though. Oh, man. But here you can see the best things to give to Leia as gifts. Now, it looks like Leia is not very superficial at all. She loves salad, vegetable stew, poppy seed muffins, stir fry, and wine. But what she hates is gems. Oh, no. Clay, stone, and seaweed. Oh, wow. And check it out. So this is how Leia looked originally. And she's undergone a lot of changes in development. And this is how she finally landed. Well, with that in mind, we got to start thinking about making food to impress Leia. Now, we're a bit of a way off making food just yet because we haven't upgraded our farm to have a kitchen. But if I look at the wiki page, it's a Sunday and nobody knows what Leia does on a Sunday. So let's see if we can track her down. Hey, Jody, she's taking the day off. Everybody's taking the day off because it's Sunday. It's 4.20 p.m. though, so who knows where she could be. Right, so another thing that happens on Sundays is a witch's cart appears. And I think I've seen it before, but apparently it only happens on Sundays and it should be down around here, between the wizard's tower and, uh, and this ranch. Let's see if we can find it. There it is, and there's the witch. Oh, wow, and she's got like a purple pig. All right. Oh, and, and check this out. Oh, right, so we can buy bruschetta, an omelette, tulips, or sandfish. Well, let's think about this. Was there anything on this list that Leia likes? Vegetable stew. No, it doesn't look like it. But we can buy some salad from the saloon, apparently. But food for thought, we can always come back here for ingredients and special meals. Let's hightail it to the saloon to see if we can find Leia a pretty sweet gift. Well, howdy. Right, salad is only 220 gold. That's pretty good. So what we can do is we'll buy two of those. In fact, we'll buy, we're going to buy four because if it's the perfect gift, we can give it to Leia and try and secure her hand in marriage. Right, let's go and see if we can track her down then. Oh, what's this? It's a cutscene. It's Linus. He's going through the trash. I could, I'd say something, but I just did exactly the same thing. Oh, somebody scared him off. What? Oh, it's me. Grr, sounds like those raccoons are back again. Filthy varmints. Ah, you turned up at the right moment, son. Could you do an old man a favor? Could you go around the corner, scare off those raccoons? They've been causing a real mess. Thanks. Make sure you give them a good scare so they never come back. No sweat. No sweat. Was it George or Clint or Client or... Hey, Linus. How's it going? <laughs> oh, dear. It was me. I'm sorry. Oh, he just, he just wants something to eat. I find a lot of hot, fresh food in these cans. Stuff like that will go to waste if I don't take it. Do you think there's something wrong with what I'm doing? No. It's a shame for food to go to waste. Thanks, Jin. I knew you were an open-minded person. I feel good about what I'm doing. I'm not harming anyone. Well, you're not harming anybody, but I don't know. It's not very hygienic. You can go on home. I promise I won't rummage in George's can anymore. Yeah, all right. Stick to the other cans. I'll tell him I scared off the raccoon. Son of a bitch. That's disgustingly squelchy. Wait! It's going to give him some food. I know what you were doing, Linus. If you need food, just ask. I don't want anyone in Pelican to... Ah, oh, look at nice guy Gus. This guy's a real champ. And I love this game. Here, I've got a basket of zucchini fritters for you. Just make sure you dip them in my spicy marinara. Go on, take it. Sweet, 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 spicy fritter things. All right. Well, it's now 8.20 p.m. And we still can't find Leia. I don't think we're going to find her today, so I'm going to head home. And we can give her a gift tomorrow. But... We've learned uh, the pretty sweet money trick today. 2,000 gold in like the blink of an eye. It's crazy. And it's a great way to start your game and get some quick and easy and free cash. 
the stuff on that island does respawn, so you can visit there after, like, I don't know how long, but you can always go back and get some more free cash, pretty much. So let's call it a night. I've been Stjin, thanks for watching Stardew Valley, and join us next episode when we probably track down Leia and uh, give her the gift of salad. Good night.